Hi, it's Lisa. In this video, I'd like to talk about two misleading studies. The first one is an egg study, and another one is a low carb versus low fat diet study. So let's start with the egg study. The egg study is called One Egg Per Day Improves Inflammation When Compared to an Oatmeal Based Breakfast Without Increasing Other Cardio Metabolic Risk Factors in Diabetic Patients. So the abstract says that. We hypothesized that egg intake would not alter plasma glucose in type 2 diabetes patients when compared to oatmeal intake. So if you look at what was actually compared, the patients were asked to consume isocaloric breakfast containing either one egg a day or 40 grams of oatmeal with 472 mils of lactose-free milk every day for five weeks. So as you can see by even the abstract of the study, the egg breakfast was actually compared to a milk-based breakfast. There was hardly any oatmeal in the breakfast that the egg breakfast was compared to, yet they titled the study an oatmeal-based breakfast. If they really wanted to make it an oatmeal-based breakfast, they would have just used oatmeal and water without the confounding factor of half a liter of milk every day. So if you compare one bad diet to another bad diet or one bad meal to another bad meal, of course one is going to look better than the other. This doesn't prove that egg intake is healthy or that it helps with inflammation. In fact, it just says that eggs don't inflame you as much as half a liter of milk. It's just a sneaky way for people who designed the study to come to a conclusion that egg intake is beneficial. So just wanted to point out those things in the egg study and you can look out for these kinds of things in other egg studies or any other food studies that compare one food to another food.